Good morning, everyone. I'm Jan Carabeo with your morning digital news brief for Sunday, June 23rd. Yet another violent night in Philadelphia. Seven people have been shot in four separate shootings. That includes a quadruple shooting in South Philadelphia. The violence happened hours after city leaders walked the streets of West Philadelphia, urging peace. A small fire continues to burn at the Philadelphia Energy Solutions refinery in South Philadelphia days after Friday's massive explosion. Crews have not yet been able to reach a switch to turn off a valve fueling the flames. So far, air quality test results are coming back safe. President Trump has put plans for a deportation crackdown on hold for two weeks. The anticipated raids had targeted more than 2,000 people across 10 major U.S. cities. House Speaker Nancy Pelosi asked President Trump to make the delay. Now to the Eyewitness Weather Forecast with meteorologist Matt Peterson. Hey, Matt. Hey there, Jan. It is going to be a great Sunday, but a shift in our pattern is going to be taking place as we move into early next week. So get out and enjoy this Sunday because this is what we're going to be expecting as we go through the next seven days. As I said, a significant change in what we've been experiencing. The weekend was great. Low humidity temperatures, very seasonable, but the summertime heat and humidity, they're going to crank up in the next couple of days. We get our first extended stretch of 90 degree temperatures, and it also is going to be stormy a couple of afternoons as a couple of boundaries come rolling on through. We could get some shower and thunderstorm activity, but before that pattern changes, if you're lucky enough to be down the shore today, absolutely gorgeous. Plenty of sunshine. Temperatures will be in the 80s. Still a little bit cool depending on where you are in the water. There, temperatures will be in the 60s to around 70 and always remember swim by the lifeguard even if we do have a low risk for rip currents today. As we go through the Sunday time frame, again, not too much to talk about, so we're jumping ahead to Monday morning there on future weather where we'll wake up to probably needing the sunglasses for that drive to work. Clouds will slowly increase throughout the day. We could even in the afternoon, even though we're not seeing a ton of it on future weather, see a couple of pop up rain showers with a chance for some thunderstorm activity. Then overnight on Monday into Tuesday morning, the drive to work on Tuesday, a little bit more difficult than Monday because of the shower and thunderstorm activity that could still be ongoing. Break in the action then starting Tuesday afternoon and even through Wednesday, but the heat and humidity are really going to start to crank up. We take a look there Tuesday. We're up to 68 for that dew point and then we stay in the 60s Wednesday and Thursday. That is more than into that oppressive range of high humidity. Here is that seven day forecast as well. 85 for our Sunday afternoon, 88 then on Monday as we start the work week, Jan, and then 89 Tuesday. And then there are those 90s starting on Wednesday, and it looks like they could last into the weekend. All right, Matt, thanks so much. And remember, you can always get the latest news and weather headlines right here on CBSPhilly.com. I'm Jan Carabeo. Have a great day.